When people say this, it always reminds me of this caption. So let me explain to you a bit about Assad's religion, himself. I'm just kidding. Or am I? Assad is what is called Alawit. Many say it is a denomination of Shia Islam, but this is technically not true. I am not well read on the details here, but from my understanding, Alawites used to be referred to as Nusairis, and there is not much known about their faith since it tends to be secretive. From what we do know, it has tenets of Islam, but really only began associating itself more with Muslims as of the early 1900s. Since I do not know much about the identity of Alawites, let me explain to you how it was exploited by France. During the French mandate in the 1920s, European powers sought to divide Arabs by encouraging separatism. They set the then-called Nusaydis on the Sunnis to deter from pan-Arabism developing. Their idea was to create a state solely for this sect. It was also apparently the idea of the French to change the name to Alawites, meaning followers of Ali, to indicate a closer connection to Shia Islam, thus prompting Sunnis to treat them as such. By the end of the French mandate, Alawites formed about half of the Syrian army. This was instrumental in allowing Hafez al-Assad to usurp control of the government and the incumbent Ba'ath party through military coups. So, is he secular? Sure, in a sense that respects individualism or the rule of law? No, it's a manipulation to convince all minorities in Syria that without him, we Sunnis would exterminate all other sects. Thanks for coming to my TED talk.